my channel it's your girl be here back with another video if you're a regular regular, welcome back and if you're new to my channel i hope you like what you see and i hope you decide to hit that subscribe button before watching the rest of the video as you guys can see in the um title of the video today's going to well today's video is basically about um uh, my detailed skincare routine if you want to put it in that way um honestly i don't know how i'm gonna go about explaining how i use both of these products but i'm going to try my best to make it really short and explain you know how and when i use these products right so um before watching the rest of the video guys please don't forget to um hit that um post notification bell so, so that you can be part of the post notification family and yeah so let's get started okay so like i said before i don't want the video to be um long I'm gonna keep it short and sweet so um if you watched my um previous um skincare routine um video thank you so much and you i'm pretty sure you already know let me just move these here and i'm pretty sure you already know how and when i apply these products gentle magic products so um um so this is basically the gentle magic um skincare soap this soap you can basically use it in the morning and at night right it doesn't really matter i prefer using it at night because my skin gets really oily during the day and I, and i feel like it cleans well it takes out all those um you know oily things and um like after you've like rinsed your face and washed your face you can feel it's like really dry so yeah so this i basically use day at night the skincare uh skin mask i prefer to use it in the morning preferably in the morning and um you should only put it on for 15 to 30 seconds and then you rinse it off i sometimes put it on for 30 minutes because in the beginning when i started using the product i would put it on for 15 to 30 seconds because it didn't really um i mean sorry yeah i used to put it on for 15 to 30 seconds because um it would sting and i could feel it burn my face but as my face got used to it i just put it on for like 30 minutes so i can you know again exfoliate and take out um all the dirt in my face and basically cleanse it as well so i would use this preferably in the morning and um the serum the serum says um in the direction thing, thing i don't know if you guys can see it says you should only use it while well, this chair is making a noise anyway <clears throat> it says you should only use it at night basically after maybe washing your face with this then you apply the serum it's basically like a night cream but for me i don't apply it at night because the day cream that they have <clears throat> okay as i was saying um sorry uh as i was saying i use the gentle magic serum at not at night <laughs> i use it in the morning and at night because um the cream that they have for like getting they they day cream or they daily cream whatever you call it for me it's too dry and like it flakes right i don't know if that's the correct word yeah it flakes and it becomes and besides like after i apply it i get really dry and my face becomes stiff so i don't use that at all but and happy my face is weird because i'm like really oily over here like on my forehead and then from here downwards i'm like really dry so that's why i prefer using the serum than the daily cream right and then next we have the um skincare lotion the cleansers you would say the skincare lotion this lotion thing thing is very strong like it's strong and i did say in my previous video that um i don't apply it everywhere because if you apply it like in these areas like around your mouth man it chows your mouth like the way it's so strong it thingies it it burns yeah that's the correct word it burns like you know the soft parts of your skin and after it burns your skin 
you become really pink or really red and then your skin starts peeling and whatnot whatnot so i prefer to use the um skin skincare lotion on my forehead and just around i don't know if you guys can see but my skin is really bad but anyway um so i just use it on my forehead and up to like here sometimes when i'm like trying it or trying my skin basically you know i use it on these parts as well but not here because i don't want to be walking around with um dry ass lips or the skin around my lips it look all dry and dead so no so and it's also really good because um before i started using this gentle magic or well, all the products or but specifically this one it basically killed all my pimples like i used to have like pimples around like right in between my eyebrows i used to get really bad and gang pimples and this lotion really helped and ever since i do get pimples now but they're not as bad as they used to be and my skin now is more cleaner as you would say than it used to be i would post a before picture somewhere here but i don't have it anymore or if i find it i'll put it somewhere here so yeah and then can i do oh i did i explain all the product so yeah this is basically it i use this in the morning this if i don't feel like applying this i usually just go for the soap and yeah this is basically like morning and night and then this i apply also morning and night but they do have the daily cream so if you want to try that out as well you can but personally it's not for me and then this i also apply morning and at night um, i wanted to say something um i don't apply the lotion because i don't apply the lotion way when i feel like my skin has had enough of the lotion because at some point if you like apply it every day you you would feel oh my your skin is like tightening up and if that happens i don't apply it like i give my skin a break from this because yeah it's not good if that happens so i just give my break Moo! i just give my face a break <laughs> from using it if that happens and okay, let me just put these to the side to the side there you go. yeah let me put these here next as you guys can see <sighs> the other products i used okay let me start off by saying um e45 i used to well, I've been using E45 for the longest, longest, longest time. E45 is like my... What's the word? You know the thing that you go back to when you feel like all the products have just um, turned their backs on you and you know her like... This is the one thing that would never turn its back on you. That is E45 for me. I've had this for and I've used it for a very long time and it works. It, it's tight. It's tight. It's tight. But I'll explain why I have it here. And then Benzac uh, AC Fab Wash. I started using literally like a week ago. <laughs> a week ago. This is basically, this is um, acne treatment or acne wash or acne, but it's acne based, right? And then we have the um, Benzac AC 5 gel. So now let me tell you something about these products so like i said i started using these products like a week ago is it a week ago or a few a few days ago but not more than two weeks right yeah not more than two weeks um i don't really know how to feel about these products but what i can say is you see the um they wash i like their wash because it's like it's very quiet if i could say it's very quiet like when you apply it on your skin it's it doesn't burn it doesn't um it doesn't irritate the skin basically like it's very quiet and after like washing it off you can feel like your skin is it's dry it's clean you know so that's what i can say about the wash it's not bad and also like when i apply the wash let me tell you something I used to apply the wash. Okay, well, you, you have to, but it, it just depends on what you want to do as a person. But what I've been doing, I've been applying the wash on the affected areas. I don't know if you guys can see, but 
my affected areas are like my cheeks basically so that's what i've been doing but i've also um when i read something that said um i can apply it everywhere i was afraid to apply it everywhere because um it said that we sh you should avoid um applying the thing around your eyes and whatnot but i found a way to rinse it off without um without it you know getting into my eyes and whatnot because my eyes are very sensitive as well so you can imagine but i'm happy with the wash the wash is quiet it's it's not stressful it's yeah and also you only apply the wash on your face you just put it on for um 30 seconds after 30 seconds you rinse it off and with this i am listening to the instructions because i don't want to be putting on for my 30 minutes next thing um i am damaging my skin because i'm still you know a bit what's the word i'm still a bit is it skeptical i don't want to say skeptical but i'm still a little bit you know unsure and whatnot with this product because i just started using it and i don't want to say it has worked for me and or it hasn't worked for me because like i said i just started using it and then with the gel i have a problem with the gel the gel is my problem the gel is my problem guys like i don't know if maybe i've been applying it like wrong or what but the gel for me yes it's it's strong like it's really strong and it burns and it burns like crazy but i read i read something this morning that and i also watched a video that um the first few weeks or the first few days of using these products because they're getting used to your skin right um it basically says like the first few days the products will burn and your skin will peel and um all those other side effects that i've been going through like my face is burning at night like yeah it burns and i've been peeling okay you guys can't really see but i've been peeling and burning and all those other stuff that's the problem i have with the gel because it's really strong and then i read something also about the gel that um like if you feel like it's a bit too strong and i did not know this i just found out this today like today today's thursday yeah, today i just found out that um if the gel burns you and um and if your skin is sensitive after applying the gel you can leave on the gel on the if on the affected marks for um two hours or so and then after two hours or so you can rinse it off and then apply your moisturizer that's where my e45 comes in but i'll explain that now now yeah so with this gel you can basically apply it on for two hours two hours or maybe less if you want to and then afterwards you can wash it off because guys trust me it does burn and it burns me and like when i leave it on because i thought you can just leave it on and you know continue with your night or continue with your day and whatnot but they said as soon as it burns you have to rinse it off and then apply your moisturizer and the other thing i have a problem with with this thing is that you become really dry like after applying it ne? guys on not dry like you get dry your face becomes like you've just applied some face mask thing or something but like you become really dry and i don't really like that so that's where my e45 comes in so i do apply it okay, i apply two things e45 and vaseline today i applied vaseline because after washing my face i was really dry really really dry so um but like i said when i read the thing it was like an article thing they said um like the first few days of using the product because the product is getting used to your face um you will experience all these side effects and whatnot so yeah my face is gonna be dry and whatnot for the first for the next coming weeks or days but that's okay i will thug it out so when my face becomes dry after i apply this thing i apply my e45 because it's a cream doesn't burn doesn't do anything and also I apply vaseline because for me vaseline is like my go-to like, if I'm experiencing any problems, get has a sleep. And a lot of people know this. Get has a sleep. Like I don't play a sleep. Like sleep is that is my baby. That is my go-to. So, but I don't have a chair because it's not here. And yeah, that is basically it. So I use these products. Let me just summarize. Let me just summarize everything I just said. These two products here. Yeah. These two products here, yeah, 
I'm only using them for my acne because my face yeah there's just a lot happening with it so these are just used for acne nothing else and then I apply this because the gel makes my skin very dry and also apply this cream yeah and then these this is what I mainly use like before I let me, let me explain this as well huh. hmm, hmm, hmm. where do I even start before washing my face with this or the affected areas with this I wash my face with the gentle magic soap or the face mask right and then after I've dried up my face and everything I apply the Benzac um, water based um, thing on the affected areas and then wash it off and then um, after washing it off I apply the acne gel not everywhere not like everywhere i just applied on my um affected areas right and then um after applying this okay now i know how i can wash it off <laughs> but after applying the um ac gel i don't know which one to use but normally i would use my e45 and my vaseline because like i said it gets really dry but now i also know that i can use my um serum i will try that after my face stops being dry and peeling off because this also makes my face not really dry but like it doesn't moisturize it the way vaseline would moisturize your face you know so yeah and oh yeah before i even forget i also apply this but only on my forehead literally just on my forehead i don't apply any oily stuff on my forehead because my forehead is very oily and that is basically 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 it this is my um <laughs> so in conclusion this is what i use well this is my detailed skin routine and but i will do like a follow-up video on how i feel about these products and if they will work on my face or not but we'll see when we get there but these are the products i use for my face layer vaseline i just don't have it here and that is basically it Guys, if you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for tuning in. And um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share. And yeah, guys, till next time. Bye.